Hello, this is a quick review on the sliding door latch from Innovative Door Solutions. I just installed this. Issue we had was um, the dogs can get the door open and if they hear um, mailman or they hear anybody coming down the driveway, the dog can just come up with their two paws and slide the door open and uh, go out when you don't want her to. And even the cat can kind of paw it enough to um, get it to slide open. So we actually tried, they have a automatic uh, door closer for patio doors, but we tried everything for adjustments and it would not, it didn't do a very good job. So um, it would leave the door in the open position. Um, so anyway, um, you might have good luck with that, but I sure didn't. But this was the next option. Um, these run a little over $50, so it's not a whole lot for the money as far as uh, what you're getting. It doesn't feel terribly robust, um, but it does seem to work mostly as intended. Um, so it's spring-loaded here, this latch. Um, so you turn the knob, and that releases that latch. Then you let it go. And uh, as long as you shut the door just enough, it latches it, so you can't just pull it open. You kind of have to use two hands sometimes to um, push the door a little bit towards a closed position to release the pressure, and then open it, and then uh, close it and it latches. Like I said, it does a pretty good job, and the good thing, forgive the crudeness of this video, the good thing about it is you can open it from either side. Um, a lot of solutions I found just didn't have that option at all. So I'm kind of using my foot a little bit to push it a little bit because it catches a little bit. And there are um, some adjustments because um, I have this extra lip here. I, we had to put the extra spacer on this part. And there's also another one that can go on the outside if you need it for some reason out there. If this if your door is too thin. Then I have one of the spacers behind this latch for the catch. And there's another one that I could have used, but I just needed the one. And it just depends on where exactly you install the mechanism on your door, you know, with whether or not you're gonna need um, one of the spacers or not on the uh, catch side. My main concern with this is one of the features you open it all the way, and it latches all the way open. That's if you're having a party or whatever, or whatever whatever reason you don't want the door to be opened by uh, children or pets or whatever. Um, if that's not a concern, if you're having a party or whatever, um, you can have it in the open position. But the problem is, when you push that button, you see that didn't open all the way. Uh, so I'll explain the other issue here. That's kind of related to that. Um, but it's just too easy to do that, in my opinion. You know, you kind of naturally, with a knob, you turn it all the way. So, um, it's easily kind of spoiled or foiled. Um, if you turn that latch all the way, and then all of a sudden, it's the latch is no longer doing anything that it's supposed to be. So, it's nice to have that option, but it's just, I feel it's a little too easy to do that. But the other issue, uh, kind of related to that, is that this is on here pretty well. Um, I don't know if you can see, it wiggles a bit. So it's on there pretty well, but if you kind of see, it is wiggling some. If you have it closed, you actually see it coming you know, in and out a little bit on there. The issue is if you tighten it too much, the spring, doesn't return all the way. It gets caught like down, you know, down a position like that, so it won't latch at all. And even in this, and even the, the tightness I have these screws now, um, sometimes it doesn't want to come back all the way. So it's kind of a fine line. So I think that's, I don't know, I emailed the company, I'm waiting to see if there's some kind of solution there. But if you do have a situation like mine where you don't want your dogs chasing down delivery people or strangers or whatever. Um, this is, see that didn't even close up anyway. So I'm not thrilled with it, but 
it's the best I found on the market. And we'll see how long it lasts. It's you know it's just basically mostly all plastic and uh, seems to be a little um, buggy. But um, so far I like it, but it's kind of expensive and I'm not wowed. I mean, as soon as I tightened the screws, it was uh, not returning. So I've got it on there just enough to allow the latch to move. Um, but like I said, the whole mechanism is, is still a little wobbly on there. So um, again, overall, it does its job for now. I'm concerned with how long it will uh, last. And um, see how see how often the latch gets turned all the way and it's not shutting because of that issue. So uh, just a little. I I didn't see any other reviews on this on YouTube. And uh, anybody out there uh, checking it out? Um, that's kind of my first impressions. Thanks for watching.